Hi, I'm Mike. And hi, I'm Ash. And uh, we were having some fun today. We were out back uh, at the fire pit area, and we thought we'd do what we always do. we crack some crayfish. And uh, we, we were cracking crayfish. We were going to make some, uh, what were we going to make? Oh, those seafood crepes you make. Those are <laughs> off the hook. At the, at the end of this video, we'll show you how to make seafood crepes and show you a picture. It's something you're definitely going to want to do. Um, but uh, I, was, I was cracking crayfish, and Ash kind of... Swamboozled me a little bit. Well, so we've seen a lot of videos on YouTube about people, you know, cleaning out crayfish and we're like, man, that's not what we do, and they're not getting all the meat out, and we do things a little differently. And, and I'll admit, you know, years ago, I I wasn't very good at it. And then you totally showed you showed me the way, and there's a way of doing it, and uh, I just think our way's better. When you crack a lot of crayfish, and I crack a lot of crayfish. There's a certain way to do it. I've never seen it done this way before, so it's kind of like it was a secret until well, somebody convinced me to... I kind of drug it out of them. You know, <laughs> we, we haven't done a video for a little bit on YouTube, and, and we, we thought, let's, let's make a good video. So it was, it was kind of a, a seat of the pants, you know, fly-by-night thing, and uh, I think you're going to like People it. People struggle cracking crayfish. I'm going to show you a way where you can crack into any crayfish super fast, crack the claws, crack the tail, you can get as much meat as you want so you can make seafood whatever. And uh, But it's going to be really fun, so what are we going to do next? Let's, re let's, <laughs> let's release the Kraken! <laughs> <laughs> let's release the Kraken! Come with us, we'll show you how to really do it. I think you're going to enjoy it. Awesome. Have a good one. So we got up early this morning and just did a really quick little crayfish run. Threw we some did. traps out. Oh, it was fun. We got some really, really huge crayfish. Got some big ones there. We're, this is just some of them we got. We're just going through some of them. We're, uh, what are we going to make tonight? We're going to make your... We're seafood crepes. Oh, dude, your famous <laughs> seafood crepes are really good. You said I could win awards with those. You know, uh, this is no joke. You know, you may not know this, but Mike really cooks well. But his seafood crepes, I mean, I was <laughs> literally blown away. It was really good. It was so good. We're going to do it. We're going to do it here soon. He's had it before, but we're going to do it again. Oh, man. That's so good. Man, I'm telling you, you can show crayfish. Like, it's going out of style. It's quick. <laughs> I, I get in some crayfish pretty fast. I mean, I, I okay, I know you've showed me how to do it, but do you think I could talk into showing the guys on YouTube how to do it? No, we're good. Oh, I'm not, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's my, it's my secret. Look at this guy. Nobody knows how to do it. Okay, I'll tell I you. I can do it with my eyes closed. I know, because you've done a lot of them. Yeah. I mean, I've had meals over here that were just crayfish, and I didn't show any of it. It was all you showing. How about this? How about this? How about if I entice you with a bottle of bourbon? Seriously? Yes. You pick. A good I pick? A good bottle of bourbon within reason. Hundred dollars and under? Hundred dollars and under. I'm in. Okay. All right. So you'll show us your secrets to shelling out crayfish. I, I will sh I will show you for, for for that amount. Okay, that sounds yeah, good. Let's show do us it. how it's done. All right. Well, you know, when you're done with this one. Well, well I'm actually, about done. Yeah, I guess <laughs> you're about done with that. Well that one doesn't count. That one doesn't count. <laughs> okay, show us how it's done. All right, you take a pincher. You go like that, you put your fork in there like that, crack it like that, pretty much get all the meat out quickly. And you can see how fast it can go. It's really not that big a deal. And I've, all, I've never quite understood why people struggle with it. It's just kind of <laughs> get the whole thing out there. Oh man. And then this is the interesting part right here because this goes so fast, people are like, how did you get that tail done so quick? Holy cow. Look at the size of that sucker. Okay. That's it, man. That's, that's it. That's all I'm doing. You're done. Okay, now I'm not saying that's worth a bottle of bourbon right there. I think what you need to do is you need to do it, but a little bit slower. So Seriously? You can tell, well, <laughs> I know you've only got one speed fast. All but right. It, but see if you can notch your, you know, take her down a few notches and <laughs> you know, run her at a slower speed. Good want that one to pinch you. Okay. Oh, man, that is a nice Here's one. Here's the way you do it. Okay, I'll do it slower. You just break it off right here. Okay. You just break off that little claw thing right there. And then what you do, this is the secret. You put your, your fork up in here, mm -hmm. and then you just crack it. And it this part comes out, and then you just pull the meat right out. Yep, Look that's that. how you do it. The whole thing just came right out. That's totally so, how you do it. So when you do it, when I do it, I just pull it like this, pull it like that, crack it like that. And then sometimes even if it sticks to the side a little bit, not saying it is, you just pull oh, it out with a knife. And then this one, what you want to do with this 
is you want to grab it. This top ring stays in. You put your finger right there. You don't get it at the very end like everybody else does. And yep. then you just press the end. You pull out the meat. Oh, man. And then what you do is you just pull that part off. And it's all great crayfish meat. Oh, That's dude. how you do it. That's totally how you do now it. Now you want to see it cook again? Okay, quick. One all more right, time. Hold right. on. Oh, this one's only got one claw. Look at the size of that claw. Okay. That's, a, that's a big claw. So you just put it in here. You go on the back side of the claw. Look at that. Just opens the whole thing that's up. Nice. Everybody struggles with the claw meat. Then you push this in here. You pull that out. Oh, I just threw that in there. That goes in there. That goes there. You're done. That's a whole crayfish. Boom. It was like 10 seconds. I don't remember. It's like, it's too much work. Oh, like, it's, it's not any work at all. Crayfish. It's fun. Yeah. Yep. All right. Well, that was worth a bottle of good bourbon. All right. You owe me. Okay. Thanks a lot, man. And sometimes when you're, when you're cracking crayfish, seriously, you just have to eat one once in a while. That's tradition. Doesn't matter if you're making something <laughs> or not. Let's see. Take a nice big piece of meat like that. Take a nice, look at how easy these crack. Look, and I just never figured out how nobody knew how to, to put, and then you check out this tail. Now watch. So then you take that part out. Then watch this. One, two, three. Ooh, freshwater lobster. Mmm. Oh, that's man, awesome. That's good. Mmm. So good. Well, we're gonna that's finish cracking these crayfish, and uh, when we're done, we'll we'll show you the end result. We're gonna make the seafood crepes. They are so good. We've made them so many times. Oh man. Um, but we'll show you, and then we'll give you a little hint on how to make them too. We'll show you a picture after you see it. You're gonna just totally want to make them. They're the best thing I've ever eaten. So it sounds good. Have a great day. We'll see ya.